So here I'm using iMovie to edit my video. And once it's all ready to go, I can come up here to the top right of the screen and I'm going to choose this share option. It looks like a box with a, an arrow pointing upwards. Click share. And in this, you're going to have several options. I recommend choosing file. So then it will export as the correct video file type and you can, it's viewable on other devices. And you can also easily upload it to Google Drive. So let's click file. You'll get a pop-up window and this is a chance for you to name your video. You might name it based on the lesson that you're doing. So maybe this is DE design lesson one. And this video is about how to photograph your work. These settings, you may not need to change. I would leave the quality at maybe medium and the resolution at 720 is fine. Make sure that you have video and audio and select these other settings. Click next. And now it's going to ask, where do you want to save this video? It's named with the name I gave it. And I like to temporarily save these onto the desktop so I can easily access them. But later you may want to organize it into a folder on your computer. So I choose where, desktop, and I click save. This will start automatically. And you'll see in the very, very top right corner of your window that it's showing the progress of, how, of the video that's exporting and how long it might take. This depends on the length of your video and also the export quality that you have chosen. That's why I recommended medium quality. Make sure you leave this program open in order for this to export. But now once the movie has exported from iMovie, we can see that it appears on our desktop. So here's my file for this video. To upload this to Google Drive, we're going to go into Google Drive. You can access in the waffle up here and click Drive. Then you may have created a folder for all of your classwork videos. I definitely encourage you to organize your files in Google Drive. So here I've created a folder called classwork videos. If you want to do this, you can click new folder and create a folder. I called mine classwork videos. Click create and it will appear over here. So now I need to get my video from my desktop into this folder. So the easiest thing to do is to actually enter the folder first. So I found it in my drive. I enter the folder by double clicking on it. So I want to get my photo of my desktop into this classwork videos folder. I'm going to click new file upload. We'll get a pop up window. These are all the files on our computer and I want to make sure that I've selected desktop. I can see files from today and Earlier down here, I see there's my video, photograph your work and click open. Sometimes this is a little bit easier. And one way you can do this is simply by dragging your file from your desktop into the folder. So I could also do this by just dragging and releasing over here. And it's also going to upload the video that way. So here I've uploaded. There's two items. It's showing me the progress. And because it's a video, it may take some time depending on how long your video is. It's a big file. Once the video has successfully uploaded to Google Drive, you'll see that it appears now inside of your folder. And, and now I can attach that to Google Classroom Assignment and turn it in.